My Father's Dragon. Movie Review. My Father's Dragon is a 2D animated fantasy adventure film directed by Nora Toomey from a screenplay by Meg Lefav, who wrote the story with John Morgan. It is based on the 1948 children's novel of the same name by Ruth Stiles Gannett. Voiced by Whoopi Goldberg and Ian McShane, along with Jacob Tremblay, Caden Matarazzo, Colshift Farani, Diane Wiest, Rita Moreno, Chris O'Dowd, Judy Greer, Alan Cumming, Yara Shaidi, and Jackie Earl Haley. An invisible old woman tells the story of her father, Elmer Elevator, when he was a kid. He and his mother, Della, owned a candy store in a small town but were soon forced to close as the townspeople moved away. They move to a distant city and plan to open a new store there, but they lose all their savings. Elmer soon befriends a cat and finally gets the idea to manage the money the store needs, only to tell his mother that it's a lost cause. Enraged, Elmer runs to the docks to be alone. The cat came up to him and started talking to him. She tells him that beyond the city there is a dragon on an island called Wild Island. Elmer takes on this mission and takes Soda, a bubble whale, to the island. When they reach the jungle island, Soda explains that Siwa, a gorilla dragon, is used to keep the island from sinking, but it is ineffective. Elmer frees Boris, the goofy dragon, and as Boris does forever, they go on an adventure to find Arachua, the tortoise, to figure out how to save the island from sinking for the next century. Be the after dragon, but after Elmer rescues him, he can't fly due to a broken wing, reveals he's afraid of water and fire, and they make a deal that Boris will help Elmer to find enough money to buy a new store and Boris will be released after the completion of the new store. Along the way, some of the island's inhabitants, Cornelius the Crocodile, the Tiger brothers Sasha and George, and the mother rhino named Iris, try to avoid Siwa and his monkey army. They soon reach Arachua's shell, but Elmer finds her dead as the island continues to sink. Resting in a flower, they are discovered by Siwa and his forces, and Saiwa reveals that he knows about Arachua's death, which infuriates Quan, his macaque 2 and D in command, who uses a giant mushroom as a raft to escape the island, convinced that it was hopeless to save. While flying with Boris, Elmer has an epiphany, roots under the island pull it down. He forces Boris to fly with all his might, Boris manages to free the island from the two roots, but he suffocates in fear of the fire, and Elmer falls off the island as he falls. Siwa rescues Elmer, revealing that he and the other animals are leaving the island, and scolds Elmer for wanting to use Boris for his own gain. When he learned of Arachua's death, he was afraid to upset everyone more, and even more so when Boris came to save the island, Siwa got tired of his stupidity, so he lied and said he knew how to control Boris. Wanting to make things right, Elmer returns to the island, where Boris tells him he found a way to save it by jumping into the fire, and finally, he explodes and magically lifts the island out of the sea, eventually transforming into a dragon. Boris takes Elmer home, passing by a surprised Quan residing over on tangerine trees. Elmer reunites with his mother and the movie ends with Elmer embracing his new life in the city with his daughter narrating the end of the story.